Yeah, right then guys, here we go, the little MG. Yeah, so the MG Maestro, non-turbo, probably a good thing, the FI as we used to call them, well they are. Uh, that's nice, rear window sticker. Austin Rover rear window sticker on it. And number plate. And number plate. Yeah. yeah, this is nice. Very Tovar nice. as well, look, missed yeah, that bit. Yeah. Tovar, tow so your caravan. caravan. Or your speedboat. Speedboat, speedboat. Oh, speed oh, <laughs> your Fletcher Arrow speedboat. That's, That's it. Lovely little car, isn't it? It came in on Saturday. I saw the chap bring it in and he had it a little while, apparently. It's about eight years or something. I'm not too sure. Check it out yourself. But uh, it's obviously been painted, actually. But what a nice looking little thing. And uh, a little flying machine. This was, this worried us in the day, you know. <laughs> People kept saying, that goes right wrong, then. it's scrap, you know. <laughs> that goes wrong, scrap the car, finished, done. And, uh, oh, worry. But um, anyway, here they are. So let's face it, Maestros, pretty rubbish, weren't they? Couldn't sell them all that well, really. Old people's car, 1.3s. Um, and now, with an MG badge and looking like this, everybody wants one, don't they? Mm. Um, so it's not mint, it's not perfect by any means, but it's a really nice, smart car. I mean, to be perfectly frank, you could, you could stand here and you could actually call the car immaculate, couldn't you? Yeah, you could, um, yes, you know, further that. I mean, if that car went on a show field today, it wouldn't disgrace itself. No, not one bit, no, no, no. There are a little few bits and pieces that I want to address, and I just open the door and notice it straight away, because that's, everyone knows now, that's where my eyes go to. Forget about anything else, the ding in the wing and all the rest of it. Look at the shafts, always giving an indication what the motor's like. A lot better on the back. Now this is the problem with these. I mean, look at it, once iron in, doesn't it? Let's mm. be fair. But, well, but what that could shrink ah, that, wouldn't it? Exactly. When we could afford it, we bought ourselves a little pitsy, putsy, whatever it's called, wet back. Best thing we ever bought for like 2000 E's and stuff like this, because this stuff, as you see, you know, it stretches and creases and all the rest of it. Give her a good old wet back, really get into it. A, it cleans it, B, it shrinks it. Everyone's a winner. Mm. Good. There you go.